one of my most intriguing storylines for this team going into this season is all the turnover on offense, the number of skill positions that, you know, we have different guys there. You know, what does the chemistry look like? What is, how's it all shaking out? And, you know, between Ben DiNucci and Mitch Trubisky passing the ball, if we take sacks out of the equation, 106 yards passing and an interception for Trubisky, it's just, it's not great for trying to get an evaluation on some of these players. Um, Mitch Trubisky looked bad, bad to me. And sometimes it's really hard to sit in this chair and be like super overly critical of NFL players. He doesn't, he doesn't look like a QB two to me. He, he looks like he has no confidence it looks like he's not finding guys like like he's not going to pull the trigger unless the guy's running wide open and even then maybe he will maybe he won't and will he hit the target if he gets there there's just so much that goes into playing the quarterback position you have to be willing to let the ball fly and maybe he's trying to to you know, keep himself upright in the league by just like not making mistakes, but by being concerned about making mistakes, he's not making any plays either. The, you know, nine for 13 for 86, like it doesn't look like the worst stat line ever, but if you watch the game, like, you know, he wasn't hitting anything, you know, throwing it down the field, there was a ton of check downs, just really not much going on and Ben DiNucci who knows I mean he's been in the building for about five minutes he had three completions on five attempts for 20 yards is what it is hopefully you know we have another regular season where Allen can stay healthy you know fortunately he's been one of the most durable quarterback in the league But we're also looking at, you know, uh, the NFL being a league where the number of starting quarterbacks the teams had to roll out last year was an all-time high. Uh, It's kind of like the offensive line for me. We had great health luck last year. We'll see. we'll, We'll hope for it to continue, obviously. But I have some very real concerns if we need a backup quarterback to come in and do anything more than hand the ball off or, you know, kneel out a game.